Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in. Today I have for you a very exciting fashion video and I've partnered up with the brand Lisa Q and I have some of their gorgeous designs. It's a New York based brand. Um, they are very ethical in terms of their production. They produce everything locally here in New York. The fabrics that they use are absolutely amazing. Everything is sourced from Japan. Um, and yeah, they're just a great brand and um, I recently discovered them but they honestly have some amazing designs they've got really good stuff which would be very appropriate for professional wear but, but I'm also going to show you ways to style these pieces up so that you can wear them more casually on your time off or if you just don't have such a formal job and also to wear um, on a night out or to a cocktail party so I'm so excited to show you all these designs and styling ideas so let's get started but before that don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you already haven't and also the little bell right next to it and also don't forget to follow me on Instagram for lots more fashion content Okay guys, so just to tell you a little bit more about Lisa Q, she's a young designer who didn't start the brand a very long time ago. She's based in New York, but she's originally Australian. Um, she sources all of her fabrics from Japan, and honestly, the kind of quality that they use in their fabrics, I went in to see the whole collection, and I touched everything, and they just feel so luxurious. Everything is fully lined, um, and the kind of finishing of the items, the kind of way they're cut, the way they fit their body, and the kind of fabric and the quality, how they feel, when you touch them honestly is something comparable to like Celine, Chloe, those kind of very very high-end brands but this obviously doesn't have the crazy crazy price tag attached to it. I also love that Lisa personally takes so much care of every single garment that goes out. She makes sure that the quality of everything is perfect. There's no threads coming out, there's no seams that are not properly sewn. That is the reason why they don't retail in big stores and they only retail through their website. I will be linking all the items down below but it's so nice to know that she personally checks every single item that goes out which um, I think is something very personalized and very difficult to find these days and you sometimes don't even get that when you're paying for um, you know very very premium luxury so um, that's really lovely and I also have a great discount voucher for you guys which I will be telling you all about at the end of the video so stay tuned for that So we're gonna start everything off with this dress, which I think is a great, great basic. Um, it's this black mini dress. Um, so I, in her clothing, I am a size zero, sometimes a double zero. Normally I am a size extra small, but sometimes I can be an extra, extra small. So um, I've lost a little bit of weight recently, so I am an extra, extra small um, in a lot of cases. So I would say um, that if you're an extra small, extra, extra small, go for the size zero, which is the smallest she does. In some cases, I think for some pieces, I might have to tailor them just a tiny little bit um, so that they fit me perfect. They fit me okay, but I think maybe just if I want them to fit a little bit more snug, um, then you know I have to tailor them a little bit um, if I want to. But I would say that's the sort of sizing. A zero would be equivalent to an extra small, and a two would be equivalent to a small. But all the information about measurements is on their website because their sizing is a little bit different, um, I think, to other brands. So do check out their measurements on their website so that you make sure you get the right size. 
So, basically, this um, gorgeous dress, I really love this one. I think it's such a versatile piece. It comes in a few different colors. Um, I'm going to show it to you in this gorgeous black, um, which is a really nice black as well because it's very black. I find with a lot of black garments, sometimes they can be kind of like a faded black, but this one is very, very black, which I really like. And then I also have it in this color, which is like a dove gray sort of color. It's showing a bit more white on the camera, but it is a dove gray. And again, it's a really, really gorgeous color, which I think is, again, so versatile. So this dress basically fits like a mini for me because I'm not very tall. The hemline sort of falls just above my knee, um, which is, I think, very nice if you want to wear it for work because it's a mini dress and you can definitely wear it with flats, for example, because I find that midi length dresses sometimes can be harder to wear with flats if you're not very tall. But this one you can definitely wear with flats. It'll look really nice and it's, again, very, very office appropriate. However, if you do want to wear it on a night out, if you want to make it a little bit more trendy, um, uh, you can definitely obviously shorten the hem which I think is what I will do but obviously if you are taller than me then it might just fit a little bit shorter for you which is quite nice um, it's a really really gorgeous dress I love the fact that it has this detail down here so basically it does like a pleat here um, it does and then it has like fabric behind it. and I think that little detail it's a subtle detail but I think it gives the dress a little bit more interest and makes it a little bit more fun given that it's not just you know plain black um, but that just makes it a little bit more exciting um, and then it has this like cowl um, neckline which is really nice again draping very nice around the neckline um, very flattering and then I love the fact that it has these cuts here because that just makes it fit really really nicely around the bust for this one i think a size zero is perfect for me it fits really well um and yeah it's just a really really beautiful dress which i think is so versatile i think this dress could look amazing like with a shirt underneath and this would look great if you want to wear it in a professional setting. So let's say you want to wear it to work, I think with a shirt underneath, a belt and a pair of boots. It's a great kind of a little more relaxed vibe, but still very professional, perfect for the office. Um, and it'll keep you nice and warm during the winter. You can also replace the shirt for a polo neck. I think that would look really gorgeous as well and very flattering. And again, really nice for the winter to keep you nice and warm. The other option to style this dress is to do it with a belt and a pair of stilettos. I think that would look really nice if you want to wear this to like a cocktail party or a night out. And it's a great dress, again, to transition from the office to a night out. Let's say you've worn it to the office with a polo neck underneath and a pair of boots. You just switch the boots for a pair of stilettos, take the polo neck off, and you're ready to party on a night out. So I think it's a great piece. I can. It's also really gorgeous without a belt, but I just like the belt because it it gives me a little bit more shape um, around my waistline area but I think it's just a piece that you can wear in lots of different styles dress up dress down if you leave it a little bit shorter I think if you wear it without a belt um, and just a pair of sneakers it's great to wear it during the day put a crossbody bag and you're perfect to go if you're kind of running around town or if you want to wear it to brunch or something more casual on the weekend so I think there's lots of different options with it and that's what I really like about it Next up is this top, which um, I think is such a gorgeous, gorgeous top. This one is in a stretchy material. It feels so soft. I think this one is so nice and so comfortable. I think one of my pet peeves when I was working in an office was the fact that I could never feel like I was put together but also feel comfortable while I was working. And it's kind of really important when you're gonna be spending long hours in the office. Um, but this one I think is something you could definitely wear to work. You can wear it on a night out. You can do so many different things with it, but I love how soft it feels. It has this really gorgeous drape on the front, which I think is so flattering on so many different body types. I think it works so well for so many different people. Even though this doesn't feel thick, it still feels like it's really good quality. There's a lot of fabric, which makes it feel really nice. And also it's completely not see through anything and you can toss this one in the washing machine and it won't get damaged which is amazing the rest of the items they recommend to dry clean but I think it's so nice that this one you can toss it in the washing machine and it just washes so so well which is something really important for stuff that you're going to be wearing very often um, again this one is sleeveless um, which is really nice because you can layer it under blazers and stuff like that um, but I think this one is gorgeous I think it would look really nice with a belt to cinch it in at the waist and with some 
some cigarette trousers um, and some stilettos. I think that could look so gorgeous if you want to wear it um, both like to like a formal event or to wear it to work if you work somewhere where you have to be quite put together um, or to wear it to like a formalish sort of dinner. Um, I think it could work so so well and I think cinching it out the waist just gives you that really really lovely silhouette. But I think this one would also look great um, just underneath a blazer with a pair of jeans, really casual. You could wear it with, you know, some sneakers. You could wear it with some boots. Um, you could do so many different things with it. And I think it just pairs really, really nicely um, with a very casual outfit as well. Next up is this gorgeous mini skirt. I absolutely love this one. Um, I am not really a huge fan of skirts normally. I find them really difficult to wear and I also find the fact that you have to think about a top um, so much harder than with a dress. But I have been wanting one and if you remember my last vlog in London, I tried one from Marge and I was on the fence about it. I didn't know if I would buy it or not and I didn't buy it. But I'm so happy because I actually much prefer this one. This one is gorgeous. It's in a crepe sort of material but it's fully lined so it's quite thick. Um, and it does have a really nice fall to it and it doesn't kind of cling onto your body awkwardly because it has that nice thick fit um, but what I most love is the kind of drape detail again very subtle it's all in the same color looks very simple at a first glance but then it's these nice little details which make the piece really special um, and seem like it's obviously something a lot more high-end so yeah it has this really nice um, pleat kind of detail here and then it sort of folds over so there's a double layer here on the front which is really nice um, and then on the back it also has the same sort of pleating detail which is really nice it fits really lovely again you can shorten it if you want to make it a little bit more shorter but I think it has quite a nice length with this one I do think that I would need to tailor it a little bit just to make it a little bit tighter around my waist but I really love it I think it falls so nicely and I absolutely love this one with my aquasura boots and a chunky knit I think that's a great way to wear it during the winter I think it makes it you know very wearable for lots of different things if you have a more casual working environment you can definitely wear it to work but you can definitely wear it on the weekend to run errands to do so many different things i think it's so so nice and i actually really want to get my hands on something like those sock boots something that kind of falls mid calf i've had my eye on these valentino ones that i'm going to show you on the screen um for a little bit um and i really think these ones would complement the skirt beautifully i think it would make it look so trendy and so cool um so those are definitely something i've got my eye on and i also think the skirt would look amazing with a t-shirt and a pair of trainers if you want to wear it in the summer i think that would look great or you can obviously wear it with a jumper and a pair of trainers and i think that's a great way to make it a lot more casual and very very wearable um, on a day-to-day -day basis and finally i think it looks amazing with this top which is from Lisa's own range which is really gorgeous a nice belt to cinch you in at the waist gives you a little bit of definition um, and some you know high heels and I think that looks absolutely amazing but obviously you could pair this with you know um, a t-shirt and a pair of flats you could pair it with a blouse you could do so many different things with it and it comes in the lighter color um, which I think is really really nice um, and very flattering um, and it also comes in this black which is really gorgeous Gorgeous and again very wearable. I think I prefer the black one just because I think I've got more lighter tops so I think um, it would match better with my existing wardrobe but the two colors are absolutely gorgeous. Moving now on to one of my favorite pieces from her collection is this gorgeous dress. I'm sorry it's not showing up very well right now because of the lights, but I will definitely be showing you cutaways. But this dress is absolutely gorgeous. This is in their sort of ivory color, um, but it does come in a black as well, and I love it in both colors. I'm so undecided about which one I like more, um, but it's so gorgeous. I love this sort of a draping detail here. It does have a cut here under the bust, which I think is very, very flattering. I think this one is gorgeous if you wanna wear it for a more formal event because of that midi length, but obviously you can wear this to work as well. You know, pop a blazer over the top and it just looks perfect for work with some stilettos. Um, but you could also just make it so much more dressy, um, you know, and wear it to a cocktail party. I think paired with some really beautiful chunky jewelry, some sparkly heels,
heels. It could look amazing um, to wear for a cocktail event, for a, for a wedding. I mean, if you were okay to wear black for a wedding. Um, but yeah, it just would look really gorgeous for a formal event. And I also think it looks really, really lovely cinched in at the waist again with a belt. Um, I think here with um, the belt, it just kind of accentuates your silhouette even more. It does look really nice without the belt because it is kind of a little bit body hugging, but I think with the belt, it just gives it that extra sort of va va voom, um, which is so, so flattering. Um, I really like the way it drapes on the body. The fabric is again, super, super soft. It's actually a very similar fabric to a dress I used to have from um, Diane von Futzberg, which was red um, and it was really gorgeous. I love this neckline. I think it's very flattering and I like the fact that it has no sleeves again, because if you didn't want to pair it with a blouse underneath because it's a little bit colder, you could definitely do that. Or if you want to pop on a blazer, I feel it's nice when they don't have sleeves because otherwise you can feel a little bit too compressed. The fabric is a little bit stretchy and it has a little bit of give, which makes it really nice and very, very comfortable. But at the same time, you look super polished. Um, and yeah, I just really, really like this fabric. I think it's very flattering and it feels amazing quality. The dress is fully lined. Um, and yeah, just a gorgeous dress, which I think you could wear with so many different things. And again, in two colors that are so versatile and that would go with pretty much anything in your wardrobe. And then finally, this other piece from her collection, which again, I think this one and the dress are probably my two favorite bits. It is this separates combo. Um, sorry, I'm like blocking my face. I'm gonna put them down. Um, but it's this beautiful pencil skirt. I think for this one, I definitely need a little bit of tailoring. I think because I would like it to fit a tiny bit more snug and just be like a more fitted pencil skirt. But if you don't like them to fit too snug, then it does have a beautiful fit. In this skirt, I really love the detail of the little opening here. I think it is so flattering. And I think if you want to wear it more in the evening and make it really glamorous for evening wear what I would do is if you're not very tall like me I would open the slit up a little bit which is what I'm planning to get tailored but if you want to wear it for office wear or if you are a little bit taller than me then it definitely has a really nice length and if you want to have a versatile piece that you can wear to the office but you can also wear you know out at night then I would leave it the length it is but because I don't work in an office I would basically want to open it a little bit more and just make it a little bit more sexy um, but I just love this detail the ruffle detail on the front it goes all the way from the top it has a double ruffle and then it goes all the way down and it's a little bit longer than the skirt I just think that makes it so glamorous and such a special design I really love that design detail I think it makes it really really special um, and then obviously matched with its um, top is absolutely gorgeous this top it's like a crop top but I like the fact that it's not too short unless you're really really tall um, because it, I, I don't really like showing my midriff um, and I think this one has the perfect length it goes so well with like a high-waisted skirt like this but at the same time you're not showing any skin which is really nice it has a really beautiful cut around the bust it fits really lovely um, and again this fabric is just gorgeous it's kind of similar to the fabric of the dress all completely fully lined um, and just really nice and I love the fact that it has the exposed zip all the way down the back which I think is a really nice design detail again quite subtle but just makes it look very high-end and very special um, I love these pieces together I think they look so great and it just makes such a special outfit you can pop on a belt like I've done here but they, it also looks great without a belt and I think it's a really beautiful formal outfit that you could definitely add a blazer to and wear it to the office and it would look great um, I think it would also look amazing with a blazer and a belt and nothing underneath the blazer um, and just kind of accentuating the skirt that would look really cool but I also think you can make this a lot more casual and you know add a chunky knit with the skirt and then just wear it you know with some trainers or some boots I think those Valentino boots would look amazing on this but because I don't have them um, I've paired it with these ones here and I think it looks a lot more casual a lot more young I think it would also look amazing with um, this chunky knit and a coat over the top so definitely something you could wear in a more casual way and make it very winter appropriate the skirt um, but also you know paired together it looks really nice and really formal and obviously this top is the one that I had paired with my mini skirt as well so again a very versatile top I think for the top you could definitely also do a lot of stuff with it I think this one would look really nice with a shirt or a roll neck underneath for the winter um, so that you don't feel so cold it would obviously look amazing layered underneath a blazer with some black trousers or some white trousers and I also think it would look amazing with lots of different um, you know skirts um, I've got my pencil skirt here from Richard Pano, which is really gorgeous and I think it works so well together so I think it's a top that you will get so much wear out of that it's definitely worth the investment and it just 
seems such amazing quality um, and yeah just a real basic this outfit also comes in the ivory color and I absolutely love it in the ivory as well it's the same color as the um, dress and it's just so gorgeous I'm really torn between the two I don't know which one I like better um, and I don't know which one I will keep for my V I'll just keep both but yeah again so gorgeous this one also has the exposed zip at the back and I think the gold on the ivory just looks really really gorgeous um, and I think for the spring summer months the ivory would be really nice um, and the black um, would obviously work perfectly all year round so that was everything from me guys. I hope you enjoyed seeing all these pieces from Lisa Q. I am so excited because they're so beautiful and I think I'm going to get so, so much more out of them and they're great transitional pieces that can work throughout different times of the year. I have an amazing discount code for you guys. For any purchase over $250, you get $50 off. I will leave all the info on the screen and all the info on in the info box down below as well. Um, so guys, don't forget to check out all my links below. Go onto Lisa's website. Any questions, do pop them in the comments down below and um, if you do order some of the stuff, please do let me know how you get on with it and how you decide to style it because I would love to hear from you guys. So that's it guys. Thank you so, so much for watching. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram. I have lots more fashion and beauty content there. I will leave my username on the screen now and also don't forget to follow me here on my channel and click the little bell and I will see you in my next video. Bye!